Uh, I'd like to talk briefly about something that I have personal experience in that has been mentioned today, but I believe deserves deeper consideration. And that is Iran's meddling in and destabilizing its neighbors. You know, last, last Sunday, our Secretary of State, Mike Pompeo, was asked by a journalist, what is the U.S. goal with respect to Iran? And here's what he said. He said, our goal is to push Iran to act like a normal country, to act like a normal country. He said, don't support terrorism, don't launch missiles into international airports, and don't be the world's largest state sponsor of terrorism. He went on to say, none of these things are difficult. We're asking them to do the things that normal nations in the international community should do. That sounds simple, doesn't it? Yet, yet today, Iran, through its terrorist arm, the Quds Force, continues to support terrorism and destabilize not only its neighbors, but the entire region. And that's not normal behavior. And, and I firmly believe that, that no government that actually actively supports and exports terror can be a productive player in the world today. Change must come to Iran.